Hey guys, Nathan Hall here from um, Anchor Media Studio. So I just got uh, a Phil Bloom Signature Series pocket dolly in the mail from Kessler Crane. And in just a second, I'm going to open this thing up and um, just kind of give you my first impressions as I put it together, see how well it's packed, um, you know, that kind of thing. And hopefully it'll be of some help to those of you out there watching this. Okay, so here we go. Let's figure out how to open this thing. Good looking case right here. Feels pretty heavy. Not too bad though. I obviously got the three uh, the three foot model. I don't really do a ton of traveling, so open this up. Looks like a bag for the feet. Yeah, those are definitely built real well. They look nice too. Super solid. Oh, that feels good. That's like a, uh, it's kind of a hard rubber texture, but it's got some grip, so it doesn't feel like it's gonna slide, slip any. Um, cool. Set that there. Oh, I actually got the ball mount head, so that's what this is. Pretty, uh, pretty simple, nothing too complex. Okay, that's heavy duty. If you guys check that out, I guess. Ah, Getting some dirt on my couch. Um, more filler. Here's a uh, strap. We'll open that in a second. It's got some Velcro straps, which is nice. Keeps it from moving around. Pull this bad boy out. Oh. Kessler. Okay, so everything's wrapped up, looks good. It feels good. Let's make sure I don't cut that. <laughs> No lie, this thing is packed really well. All right, managed to get all that off there without cutting the, um, let's see, how do I? Sweet. that down and it, yeah it's good that's nice let's throw these feet on there and see how this thing reacts hmm. now should I use the inside or that I guess I'll go with the outside feet for now it's 
threading the feet on here. Heck yeah, that's seriously nice. I'm gonna grab my 70. Okay, let's put the ball head on. Okay, so here I am about to thread on um, my Manfrotto quick release plate. And um, hopefully this works pretty well. Throw this bad boy on the 70. All right, sweet. So, let's unlock this. Man, that is slick. That is real slick. You pay for quality. Make sure that's totally level. All right, here we go, first shot. Do a push back. Very cool. Beautiful. Have a tension release. You can actually mount um, Kessler's motor mount to this. So you can do um, motion time lapse. I didn't get that, um, but I probably will at some point in the future here. Okay, so first impressions. This thing is built extremely solid. Um, Obviously, it's beautiful. It's in, you know, red and black. Uh, looks great. The feet are extremely strong. They don't look like they're going to be flexing anytime soon, which is really nice. Um, they have a pretty good height, too. So, I mean, you can actually lift this thing probably an extra three inches off the ground at least, um, you know, if you thread the posts all the way down on each of the feet. Um, another feature I like on here is actually the the tension that way you can adjust you know how much tension there is whenever you're, you're actually doing a slide um, or you can lock it off if you know you thread it all the way down which is really nice the hand crank um, I'm not sure how much I'll use that versus just manually pushing the slider um, we'll just have to see as, as time goes on I've never actually had a hand crank on a slider before so that should be interesting and that's uh, Twitter again and that's actually Kessler Crane mentioning me on Twitter. So, uh, another thing that I like about this is actually the uh, ruler. You can actually, uh, you know, mark off shots for certain distances um, for precision shot shots, I guess. Uh, one of the main reasons why I wanted to get this is because any of the sliders that I've used in the past have kind of flexed, especially if you mount them on a, on a tripod. And um, I'm really expecting this one to not have those kind of issues. And judging from how solid this feels right off the bat, I don't think that's going to be a problem. I don't know. I guess I guess that's about it. It's it's great. Looking forward to using this on on some real jobs. I got a couple this week, so um, maybe I'll even blog about that and put those out there for everybody to see.
All right. See you.